Welcome everybody to Lindsay, Oklahoma. Your Lindsay Leopards taking on Marietta Indians. And uh, it's also senior night tonight. Uh, senior night will be in between the varsity and JV game. Uh, so I'm go ahead and uh, talk about the lineup today. We got Caleb Vince on the mound doing the pitching duties. Uh, Clayton Sanders being catcher today. And Bo Blankenship at first. Second will be Ty Ferguson. Shortstop, Bentley Kessler. Third baseman, going to be Tucker Morse. Left field, Daniel Ponce. Center field. Center field is going to be... Oh, I said Daniel Ponce. Daniel, Daniel Ponce is not playing. No, he is playing left field. Okay. Center field, Mitchell Henson. And no one out there at right yet. Nope, I'm sorry. Right field is going to be Colton Hines. So, you know, all the seniors playing tonight, so. I'll bring up number four for the Indians, Lohmeyer. And also, uh, Lindsay playing Saturday, I think, in Jones, so. Pitches away, outside, and low. They count one and zero. Hitch, that's gonna be popped over the shortstop. Ben Lee Kessler gonna throw it over to first baseman. Oh, blanket chips gonna be out number one for the Leopards. That's going to bring up uh, number eight, I believe. Pitch. That's going to be inside. No, number 16. Number 17 on deck for the Indians. That pitch is going to... That's going to hit the dirt. It called ball. So one out so far. 1-1 one, one the count. The 1-1 one, one pitch. We swung over to the second baseman. And throw it over to first. That'll be out number two. Want to bring up number 17 for the Indians. Two outs. Base is clear. Still scoreless. Again, number 17, the third baseman. Rod Rodriguez, mispronouncing that. Number 17 up to bat. Two outs away in this top of the first. Waiting the pitch. Pitches away. That's going to hit the dirt and the outside and low. Mid count 1 0. Oh. 1 0 -oh pitch. A swing and a miss. And count one and one. One one to count to number 17. Two outs. Base is still clear. The one one pitch. He popped over to the shortstop. Shortstop's going to throw over to the first. Maybe oh, I mean, an error at first. But he will decide to stay at first. So could have been an easy out, but uh, can't get the ball. So. Runner at first, two outs. That'll bring up number 23 for the Indians. Number 24 on deck. Walters, the left fielder. So two outs, runner at first. Still scoreless. Wind up, and the pitch. That's going to be called strike. So one now the count. No one. That's gonna be way high. Let's count one and one. The 
the one one. That's gonna hit the dirt and be outside. We have to count two and one now. Two one the count, two outs, runner at first. Waiting the pitch. The two one pitch. He popped over the shortstop. Shortstop's gonna throw to the second. That'll be out number three. That will conclude the top of the first. We'll be back with the bottom of the first. Don't go anywhere. You're watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network. Welcome back to Lindsay, Oklahoma. Bottom of the first, still scoreless. Bring up your first hole hitter, Bentley Kessler. Also your short stop for today. Waiting the pitch. The pitch. Be inside. Let's count. One and zero. Oh. No, that's going to be looked like inside, but he's going to call strikes. So let count one and one. Pitch going to be outside. Two one now the count. That pitch gonna be called strike. We fouled away, so it count two and two. That pitch can hit the dirt, make a full count now. So full count, payoff pitch. Let me swing over right to the pitcher. 
gonna be. Uh, wait, excuse me. No, he didn't catch it, so he uh, missed the catch, and it rolled over to second. So Bentley Kessler at first, no outs. It'll bring up your two-hole hitter. Also, the second baseman, Ty Ferguson. So runner at first, no outs. Again, Ty Ferguson up to bat. Waiting the pitch. That's going to be outside. Nope. Called a strike. Looked outside, but he calls a strike, so 0 1 the count now. Probably should wait a little bit before I say it. The 0 1. It popped over to the third baseman. Third baseman misses the grab. I'll put him at first and Bentley Kessler at second with no outs. I'll bring up your 3 0 hitter, number 11, third baseman, Tucker Morse. Third base number 11, Tucker Morris. So, runner at first and second, no outs. Waiting the pitch. That's going to be low. Mid count 1 0. Oh. Not a lot of wind today. It's kind of calm. The last few days it's been really windy, so kind of a good thing. 1 0. Oh. That's going to be popped over to the shortstop. And he's going to throw it over to first. An error over at first. That'll score one and put Tucker at second and Ty Ferguson at third. That'll make the score 1 0. Your Leopards on top. But no outs. Then bring up the four hole hitter, your first baseman, number 21, Bo Blankenship. Pitch popped over, just barely fouled, just barely over in left field. That'll make the count 0-1 to Blankenship. So 0-1 the count, no outs, runner at second and third, bottom of the first. Score still 1-0. Wind up and the 0 1. That's going to be low. It's count 1 and 1. The 1 1 be low as well. That'll make the, that'll make the count 2 and 1 to blanket chip. So 2 1 the count, no outs, runner at second and third. The wind up and the pitch. That's going to be fouled away. Make the count two and two now. Two, two. That's going to be low. Make it a full count now. The blanket chip with no outs. Morris at third, or Morris at second, Ferguson at third, a pitch, fouled away, keep the count at three and two. The payoff pitch, outs, and called it a strike. Almost at outside. He calls it a strike, so that'll be out number one. That'll bring up your five-hole hitter, number 22, the catcher, Clayton Sanders. So again, Morris at second, Ferguson at third, one out. Sanders up to bat. Score still 1-0. The 
pitches away. Fouled away. At the count, 0-1. Number four, center fielder, Mitchell Henson on deck. So on the count, one out, runner at second and third, waiting the pitch. The 0 1. Ride down Broadway, called strike, make the count 0 and 2. The 0 2. That's going to be fouled away. Keep the count at 0 and 2. So 0-2 the count, one out, runner at second and third. Again, Sanders up to bat. The 0-2. Fouled away again. So that'll keep the count at 0-2. Number five. The wind up and the pitch. The outside. Make the count one and two now. So one, two, the count, one out. Waiting the pitch. The one, two. He foul away again. So that'll keep the count at one and two for Sanders. Again. Uh, trying to remember his name now. Henson on deck. The one, two. Swing and a miss. That'll be strike number three, out number two. I'm going to bring up number four, Mitchell Henson, center fielder. Caleb Entz, the pitcher on deck. Two outs, runner at second and third. Again, Henson up the bat. Wind up and the pitch. That's going to be right down the middle called strike, mid count 0 and 1. Pitch, that's going to be popped over to the shortstop and a little error. He can't come up with the ball. That'll score one, and that'll score two. And put Henson at second. So a double RBI for Mitchell Henson. That'll make the score 3-0 now. Your Leopard's on top. I'll bring up... Caleb Bentz now, the pitcher. The pitcher's away. That's going to be low. Called ball. Hit the count. 1-0. Oh. That's going to be low again. Make the count 2-0 oh now. So two outs, runner at second. Again, score 3 0 in the bottom of the first. 2 0 the count. The 2 0 pitch. Swung over to the second baseman and can't come up with the catch. That'll score one and put Ince at first. Single RBI for Ince. That'll make the score 4 0 now. That'll bring up the right fielder, Colton Hines. So runner at first, we're going to have a courtesy runner now for the pitcher. That's going to be and in register. It's the bottom of the first, score 4-0, two outs, runner at first. 
Again, Colton Hines up to bat. The right fielder. Number 12. And Daniel Ponce, the left fielder, number seven on deck. Pitches away. Right down the middle, called strike. Make the count 0 and 1. The 0 1. That's going to be low and outside. So that'll make the count 0 and 1. So 1 1 the count. Hines, the 1-1, one, one. that'd be fouled away, with the count 1-2, and two. two outs, still runner at first. The 1-2, right down the middle. Strike three, out number three. That will con that will retire the first inning and bring us to the top of the second. We'll be back. We've been watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network. Welcome back. Top of the second inning. 4-0. Your Leopards on top. That'll bring up number 24 for the Indians. So a lot of action last inning for the Leopards. Scored four. Just got to keep going. Pitches away. That's going to be popped over to center by Mitchell Henson under that one. That'll be out number one. I'll bring up, let's see, number two for the Indians. One out away in the top of the second. Base is obviously low, or base is obviously clear. Kirk, number two, Kirk to bat. Pitches away. That's going to be called strike. Make the count 0 and 1. The 0 1. That's going to be fouled back. That'll make the count 0 and 2 to Kirk. Number 12 on deck for the Indians. So again, 0-2 the count, one out. Base is clear. Pitch. Going to be outside and low. The count, one and two now. That's going to be just fair. That will put him at second, and he'll stay at second. Nice little extra base hit there for number two, Kurt. I'll bring up 
number 12 now for the Indians. That ball just barely, barely fair. I almost thought it was a foul at first. So waiting the pitch. Just away. It's gonna be a swing and a miss. So on the count, no outs. Runner at second. Top of the second. Score still four to zero. Waiting the pitch. The wind up. The O two. Oh, one, excuse me. That's going to be high. Mid count one and one now. So one, one count, no outs. Again, runner at second. I want to apologize if it's taking me a little bit to get this uh, scoreboard updated. It keeps uh, keeps uh, disconnecting, so. Pitch, that's going to be low and outside. That'll make the count two and one. Two on the count. Waiting the pitch. The two one. Swing and a miss. At the count two and two. So Kirk got second. No outs. Again, two two the count. The two two pitch. He popped over to right field, right over the second baseman. Hines trying to get the ball. And that'll score one, so a single RBI for number 12. And he's going to stay at second. Make the score forward one now. Your Leopard's still on top, though. Bring up number three for the Indians. Runner at second, one out. Getting number three up to bat. Waiting the pitch. That's going to be outside. It's count one and oh now. Last time we played the Indians, I believe. We run ruled them, so I, I don't remember the final score though. 1 0. That's going to be fouled away. And count 1 and 1. So 1 1 to count, 1 out. Runner at second. Again, score 4 to 1 on the top of the second inning. Your Leopard's still on top though. Waiting for the pitch. The 1-1 pitch. He popped over to the second baseman, and that's going to get right by him. Bolton Hines going to throw it to first. But that'll score one. The single for number three. Single RBI. I'm going to go number five for the Indians. Four, score now 4-2. Leopard's still on top. So one out away in the top of the second. With the runner at second, or runner at first, excuse me. Pitches away. It's going to be high. Hit the count 1 0. So 1 0 the count, 1 out, runner at first. Again, the score 4 to 2. Just the, the hits are just. Right in the gaps. It's just hard to get the ball. That should be an easy out there. Throw it over to third and hit over to third. Gonna throw it over to second. That'll be out number two. Runner will be at first on time. So runner at first, two outs. That'll bring up number four from the Indians now. Lohmeyer. Two 
Two outs, runner at first. Again, Lomar up to bat. Number 16 on deck. We're going to have a uh, courtesy runner at first. Matthew, number one. Pitch. Try to steal second and will be successful. And we'll also head over to third with a little error at second. Missed the uh, miss throw. So he'll uh, be at he'll be at third with two outs. Count 1-0 with a ball. Still a lot of mistakes here for the Leopards right now. I mean they are up by two, but just a lot of mistakes. Miss throws and Errors, it just uh, gotta gotta get those fixed. So I want to count two outs. Runner at third, pitch. He popped over to the second baseman. Can't come up with the catch. It'll score one and put a runner at first. That'll make the score four to three. Leopard still on top and the top of the second. Still two outs though. Two outs, runner at first. Flanagan, number 16 up the bat. Try to pick him off at first. Runner there on time. Number 17 on deck. Try to do it again. There on time, so safe. This time he'll throw the ball, and that'll be outside. To count one and zero. The one zero, still second, and is successful. But runner will be out at first. That'll be out number three. That will bring us to the bottom of the second. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. You're watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network. Welcome back. Bottom of the second inning. Daniel Ponce, the left fielder, number seven up the bat. Score still four to three. So far, both sides' bats are just hot right now. Just uh, can't get nothing going. Defense, so. The hits are just right in the gaps, and there's too much errors, and got to get got to get that fixed. Pitch, that's going to be inside. Make the count one and zero. Oh. However, we are still up by one, so that's a good thing. The 1-0. Popped over to the right field. Second baseman up with the catch. Reach, that was a beautiful catch. 
by the second baseman. We're going to bring up, back to the top of the lineup, number 16, shortstop, Bentley Kessler. So one out away in the top or the bottom of the second. Excuse me. Again, ben, Bentley Kessler. Bat. The windup pitch. The low. Count one and zero. Oh. One with the count, one out. Pitches away. That's going to hit Kessler and put him at first. So we're at first, one out. That'll bring up the two hole hitter, second baseman, Ty Ferguson. Number three. Again, Ferguson up the bat, one out, runner at first. Bottom of the second, score still 4 3. Wind up the pitch. That's going to be outside. Going to count one and zero oh now. So one out, one zero. Oh, the count to Ferguson. One out. Runner at first. One zero oh pitch. That's going to be popped over to center, and center fielder under it. The out number one. Kessler there at first. An error at first, a missed throw. Kessler will advance over to second, put him at second, but that'll be two outs, though. I'll bring up your 3 0 hitter, number 11, third baseman, Tucker Morris. So again, Morris up the bat, two outs, runner at second. Waiting the pitch. Uh, gonna hit him and put a runner first and second and bring up the four hole hitter, first baseman, number 21, Bo Blinkenship. Blinkenship up to bat, two outs, runner at first and second. Morris at first, Kessler at second. Wind up, pitch, gonna be looked outside. He called strike. Mid count one and oh and one. Excuse me. So on the count, two outs. Runner first and second. Again, Blankenship up the bat. The O one, be way outside. Mid count one and one. One one the count to Blankenship, two outs. The one one. That's gonna hit the dirt. Make the count two and one. The two one. Be popped over to the shortstop. That'll be out number three. So that third out, that'll uh, retire the second inning and bring us to the top of the third. We're going to take a quick break. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back for the third inning. You've been watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network.
Welcome back, Rodriguez, the number 17 up to bat for the Indians. Scoreboard down again, I'm trying to apologize about that. There we go. The top of the third, two strikes already, made the count 0 and 2. Score still 4 to 3. Your Leopards on top. Pitch, that's going to hit the dirt. We count one and two now. Again, 17 up to bat. The one two pitch. That's going to be fouled away. Keep the count at one and two. Obviously, no outs. I'll put 23 on deck for the Indians. The one two. Swing and a miss. Out number one. I'm going to bring up number 23 for the Indians. So one out, base is clear. Again, 23 up to bat. Top of the third. Walters is his name. Put number 24 on deck. Pitches away. That's going to be fouled away. Make the count 0 to 1. So on the count, one out. The 0 1 pitch. Right down the middle. Make the count 0 and 2. The 0 2. That's going to hit the dirt. That'll make the count 1 and 2. The Walters. The wind up. The 1 2. It's going to be popped over to. Uh, that's going to be fouled away. That'll keep the count at 1 and 2 for Walters. Still one out away in this top of the third. Score still four to three. The one two pitch. Be way high and inside. That'll make the count two and two for Walters. The 2-2, two -two. the inside. And, uh, no, never mind, that hit him. That'll put him at first. So runner at first, one out. Bring up number 24 for the Indians. So top of the third, score four to three. Your Leopards on top with one out, runner at first. Again, number 24 up the bat. Waiting the pitch. Pitch. That's going to be high. They're going to fake the throw over first. Keep the runner at first. One over the count. Still one out. I'm going to throw it over to first, and the runner's going to be safe. I'll keep him at first. Count still 1 0. Oh. The 1-0, that's going to be over to left field. Daniel Ponce going to get the ball. It's going to be out number two. Keep the runner at first, too. So runner at first, two outs. That'll bring up number two for the Indians. Kirk, number two, Kirk, up to bat. So two outs, runner at first. Try to pick him off at first. And runner will be safe.
Pitch. Going to be bunted. Fouled back, though. Make the count 0 and 1. So won the count. Pitches away. That's going to be over to Colton Hines at right field. And I throw it over to Bo Blankenship. That'll put a runners on the corners. Still two outs. That'll bring up number 12 for the Indians. Gonna uh, think about still in second and be out at third. Gonna throw it over to home. Gonna throw it over to third. Then he'll be out. That'll be out number two. The runner at first will advance to second. And nope, he is. Never mind, he's safe. I'll put a runner at second and third now with two outs. Would have been out number three, but he's safe, so. We're bringing number 12 for the Indians. Pitch, that's going to be fouled away at count 0 and 1. One the count, two outs. Runner at second and third. Again, number 12 up the bat. Score still four to three in the top of the third. The 0 1. It popped over to tie at second and throw it over to first. That'll be out number three. We'll go ahead and take a quick break. We'll be back with the bottom of the third. Don't go anywhere. You're watching Leopard Baseball live on Leopard Sports Network. Welcome back to the Lawton Carey Field right here in Lindsay, Oklahoma. I'm Eric Dodson alongside with R.J. Brooks. Bum the third of senior night for the baseball boys. I noticed in the lineup out in the field, it was seniors were uh, had every position filled. Yeah, they added uh, Colton Hines at right and Daniel Ponce at left. Yep. So that, that's pretty neat to see on, yep. on senior night here in Lindsay. And that'll bring up the catcher, number 22, Clayton Sanders. Here comes the pitch to Sanders. 
right down Broadway, strike one. Beautiful evening. Nice weather. Wind's coming right us to our face out of the north. Just a five miles an hour, maybe. There's a base hit right up the middle, maybe. Clayton Sanders turning. He's going to get a double out of this out of the air out there in the field. It was a base hit anyway. And Clayton Sanders with the stand-up double to start off the bottom of the third. That's going to bring up center fielder number four, Mitchell Henson. And Edwards is going to bring out a courtesy runner for the catcher, Parker Dotson, number six, will be a runner at second base. Nice little spark there to start the bottom of the third. Leopards up four to three in, in the bottom of the third. No out, runner at second. Henson getting the call from Edwards. Eric, I got to tell you, a lot of errors on both sides so far in this game. A lot of overthrows. And well, I'm here now. They can clean that up. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here comes the pitch to Henson. Low and inside, ball one. Dotson with a good lead at second. one old pitch, low and in the dirt, ball two. So 2-0 to Henson. No outs. They've got their signs from Edwards. 2-0 pitch. Low, ball three. Henson will probably get the take sign here no matter what. No one holding Dotson on a second. Ball in the dirt. Ball four. Selling base for Dotson. He's at third. Mitchell Henson at first base. Parker saw the opportunity and took it. No one was holding him on that time, so he's, his secondary was a little bit earlier and a little bit bigger. So as soon as that ball hit the ground, he was gone. That'll bring up the pitcher, number one, Caleb Entz. Henson was still second. Runners are second and third, no outs. One ball, no strikes to Caleb Entz. Entz backs up. And we're going to have a visit at the mound for Marietta. What a crowd out here tonight. There is. It's standing room only here. If you're at home watching, you still have time to come to here and make it and watch the festivities. I believe they're going to have senior not festivities after this game, before the JV game. JV will play a five-inning game after this one. But I believe they're going to take part in senior night directly after this game. So come on down here and support these Leopards, these seniors. Marietta leaves the pitcher out there. One ball, no strike to Caleb Entz. Runners at second and third. Their speed out there at second and third on the bases. The one old Entz. Inside pitch, he fouls it away. Strike one. Bolton Hines on deck. Right fielder. One ball, one strike. The pitch. It's going to be fouled to right field. It's going to be in foul territory, and it will drop. Be another long strike for Caleb Entz. So one ball, two strikes to Entz. Runners in scoring position. Leopard's threatening to put some more runs on the board here. The pitch. And he's going to oh. mishandle it. 
he will get the out at first, but that will score Parker Dodson. That'll make your score five to three, Leopards. Caleb Vince does a job and gets a run batted in there. That'll bring up right fielder, number 12, Colton Hines. So five to three now, Leopard, bottom of the third, one out. Mitchell Henson at second base. Henson with the big lead. He's going. Swing and a miss, strike one. But he will be safe at third base. Stolen base, Mitchell Henson. He's doing what he does. Nice speed out there. Yeah, you can do everything right, and you're still not going to get there on time no. with Mitchell Henson. No. On, on deck, the left fielder. So one out. 0-1 oh, count to Hines, the pitch. That's going to hit him, hit by a pitch. He'll take first base. So runners on the corners now. Hines at first, Henson at third. Be left fielder number seven. Daniel Ponce, the bat. A three-time All-Stater in cross country. Yeah, you definitely you, want to get him on that. There's not a whole lot of All-Staters at Lindsay, but he is a three-time All-Stater for the Lindsay Leopards in, all, in cross country. Curveball, strike one. Yeah, you, you definitely want to get him on base. That's a lot of speed there, him and Henson. So Hines at first, Henson at third. The old one to Ponce. Right down the middle, strike two. So no balls, two strikes to Ponce. Hines still second. Runners at second and third. The 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. That'll be two outs now on the Leopards. That'll bring us back to the top of the lineup. Here, shortstop number 16, Bentley Kessler. Leopards still have runners in scoring position at second and third. A base hit gives another run in here. The pitch to Kessler. Air ball, pitch. strike one. Caught the outside corner, beautiful pitch. That's one of them you need to see what go all the way to the glove and then get your timing down and then rip one here. No balls, one strike to Kessler. Tried the same pitch on the inside, but it stayed inside that time. B ball one. One ball, one strike. Kessler looking to do some damage here. The one one pitch. A little bit low. Ball two. Pretty good place ball there, just a little bit low. He caught the corner, though. Two balls, one strike. Kessler. Five one back, strike two. Two balls, two strike to count. Two outs away here to ball in the third. Leopard's up five to three. Hines is at second. Henson is at third. The 2-2 two -two pitch to Kessler. And he's going to ring him up the curveball there. Strike three, out three. And that'll be that'll do it for the third inning. We're going to take a quick timeout. We come back, we'll be in the fourth inning. You're watching Leopard Baseball Live, Leopard Sports Network.
Welcome back to Senior Night here at Lawton Carey Field. Going to the top of the fourth inning. Leopards on top, five to three. Caleb Benz is your pitcher. Peyton Sanders is your catcher. Marietta up to bat. Beautiful senior night here. Just a really light breeze in our faces from the north. This is perfect weather for baseball. Beautiful weather. Number three, Kurt, up to bat for the Marietta Indians. Strike one. Looking. The old one to Kirk. Swing and a miss. Strike two. Just like that, he, Kirk finds himself in a hole to Caleb Ince. Ince is dialed in. The 0-2 pitch. High and outside, ball one. One, two pitch. Inside, ball two. Perks, even the count back up to two and two here. Ends with the two, two. We're right down the middle. That will be a base hit for Kirk. Just a good, hard hit ball right up, up the middle. Nothing you can do about that one. So no, no outs away here and runner at first for the Indians. That pop. That was a loud pop. That bring up number five, trail for the Indians. Pitch to trail. Foul ball, strike one. Kirk tried to steal a second, but trail there. Looked like he's trying to get out of the way, and the ball hit the bat, so that's a foul ball. Strike one. Kirk retreats back to first base. <laughs> oh, one pitch. Right down the middle, strike two, watching. Trail finds itself in a whole O2 here. Ansel check his runner first. He's back in time. The O2 pitch. Gonna be popped up. Should be an easy out. Sanders with the catch and out number one. So one away here. Top of the fourth. Indians still have a runner at first. That'll bring up number four for the Indians. The pitch. Ah, Kessler can't get the handle on it. He will reach on an error. So runners at first and second, one away. That'll bring up number 16, Flanagan, for the Indians. So Marietta's trying to threaten here a little bit with two base runners at first and second, only one out. Sanders getting the sign from Edwards. Ants is ready. The pitch. Be handled by Bo Blankenship at first base. For out number two, runners will advance to second and third. Two outs.
Empires. You know what's going on here, Eric? They made him go back. Well, they called the runner that was at first out, and the runner that got thrown out, the batter that got thrown out at first, they're calling him safe. I don't know that I've ever seen anything like that. Marietta coaches want an explanation. And I'm sure he's getting one. We've got an experienced veteran umpire crew today. So two away here. Nothing's changed. Runners at first and second, two outs. Number 17 is your batter for the Marietta Indians. The pitch. High ball one. One old pitch to seventeen. Gonna be fouled away. Strike one. Two outs, runners at first and second. Top of the fourth, Leopards lead five to three. Ants with the 1-1 one, one pitch. Low and outside, ball two. Ants settles in. 2-1 pitch. Foul back, strike two. Two balls, two strikes to number 17 for the Indians. Clayton Sanders gets the call from Edwards. Ant settles in. The pitch. Hi. Oh. Would have been out. Morris missed the catch. So runners will bet the second and third on the error. That should have been out number three. And sometimes, uh, RJ, that ball's kind of hard to see. when the, you, got, you know the runner's coming towards you. The ball's coming to you. You're looking right in the sun. Yeah. Everything's got to be just right. If if he crosses in front of you for the ball, gets, it's just hard to see sometimes. It is. It is, yeah. Especially right there at third. Swing and a miss, strike three. It don't matter anyway. That'll end it for the top of the fourth for the Indians. We're going to take a short break. When we come back, we'll be at the bottom of the fourth. We Leopards be batting. You've been watching Leopard Baseball Live on the Leopard Sports Network.
Two, one. Welcome back to the Lawton Carey Field Senior Night, baseball style tonight. Going to the bottom of the fourth inning, Leopards up five to three. Leopards going seniors all the way tonight. And up to bat for the ball in the fourth is going to be your second baseman, number three, Ty Ferguson. And my partner, RJ Brooks, made the right call. We was talking off the break, the reason that runner called earlier off that was at first base. It was interference there with, with Bo Blankenship when he's trying to make a play. First pitch is low, ball one. So that runner at first was called out for interference, but the batter was allowed to, to make it two first because of the interference. Ferguson shows bump, pulls it back. Ball was low, ball two. Three-hole hitter, uh, third baseman, Tucker Morris on deck. Right up the middle, base hit, Ty Ferguson. Just like the top of the, the bottom of the third inning, Leopards start off with the base hit right up the middle. That'll bring up third baseman, number 11, Tucker Morris. So no outs here, ball in the fourth. Ferguson with the lead at first. The pitch to Morris. Right down the middle, going to be there at second base. That'll be a base hit, Morris. What could have been a double play ball turned into a base hit. Runners at first and second, no outs for the four hole hitter, Bo Blankenship. Blanket ship getting the call from Edwards. Wait, Sanders on deck. The pitch. Outside, ball one. One ball, no strikes to Blanket ship. Winners at first and second. Ball outside, ball two. Now, that slow off-speed curveball that this pitcher has could be dangerous to a left-hand batter like Bo Blankenship. He has a lot more long, longer time to see it. Just like that, hit in the gap. That's going to score Ferguson from second. Be a base hit, Bo Blankenship. And that's what I was just talking about. When you have a right-handed batter going against a left-handed batter, Going against a right-handed pitcher there, and he throws that slow off-speed curve. He's got all that time to get his timing down. We're going to take a quick timeout. Mary is going to make a pitcher change here. You're watching Leopard Baseball Live on the Leopard Sports Network.
Marietta in is bring in number three Walter at the pitch. Bring up her catcher, number 22, Clayton Sanders. Scores now Lindsay six, Marietta three. Bottom of the fourth inning here. Runners at the corners. And it's going to be a hit. I nice said. And it's going to go through. Tucker Moore scores. Bo Blankenship is going to go in. The third from first base. And Clayton Sanders have his second double of the game. In comes number six, Parker Dawson, the Curtis run. Courtesy run for Sanders. There's still no outs. So seven to three Leopards, no outs for center fielder number four, Mitchell Henson. Really in a good spot right here. Wind's trying to go a little bit more from left to right now instead of directly in our face. The pitch in the dirt, ball one. Watching this pitcher in warm ups. Every time he tried to throw an off speed or a curve, you could tell his arm was doing something different. So they should pick up on that. Otherwise, it's the same motions as that right there. Mitchell Henson will foul that one away. One ball, one strike to Henson. No outs. Bomb of the fourth. Dotson at second, Blankenship at third. One one to Henson. High and way inside, ball two. Two balls, one strike to Henson. Leopards in scoring position, second and third. Base hit scores two here. Timing's just not quite down yet. He's early on that one. Pitcher's way off speed here. So that foul will make the count even up here at two balls, two strikes. Which is when Mitchell Henson gets serious. It seems like every time he's forced to do something, he does it. The pitch. He digs up under. It's going to be popped up. Second baseman is there to make a kit catch. Blankenship and Dawson will remain at second and third. One away here for the Leopards. That'll bring up number one, the pitcher, Caleb Bentz. Also put. Uh, 12, Colton Hines on deck. Right fielder. So here we go. First pitch to Ince. Going to be a grounder. It's kind of Air. mishandled. <laughs> Ince is still thrown out at first, but that scores Bo Blankenship. That'll make your score the Leopards eight, the Indians three. So Ants with another RBI there. Just about got it. Just about got saved. Two outs, bottom the fourth. Dotson, the runner at third. I'll bring up right fielder, number 12, Colton Hines. Hines had a base hit last inning. The pitch. Outside, ball one. So Leopard's threatening here to do a little bit more damage. They've scored three so far in the bottom of the fourth. Ball two, high. So Hines making this pitcher pitch. Doing his job here. Dotson, the lone base runner. The 2-0 pitch to Hines. 
Swing and a miss, strike one. That's one of them curveballs. It looks like it's coming right across the plate, and then just falls out of sight. That's a good pitch. Two balls, one strike to Hines. Good base hit. Right hit. The middle. And he's going to reach base. That's going to score Parker Dotson. And Hines now two singles in a row here. So Leopards nine, Indians three. Colton Hines on first base. Let him bring up number seven, the left fielder, Daniel Ponce. Hines with the commanding lead. It'll be high and way inside, ball one. Number 23, Curry pitching for the Indians. One ball, no strikes. Two outs, bomb the fourth. The one over to Ponce. Fouled away, strike one. So put uh, 16, the shortstop, Bentley Kessler on deck. Hines with a good lead at first. The 1-1 one -one pitch to Ponce. Almost hit him. It oh, did hit did him. him. They'll be hit by a pitch. He'll take his base. So now the Leopards have runners at first and second. Two outs. We'll go back up to the top of the lineup. Number 16, your shortstop, Bentley Kessler. Leopards could do some more damage right here. Outside corner, strike one. Looks a little bit too far outside from here, but that umpire is more educated than I am. You did say they're vets, right? Yeah, they, they are. Yeah. We got a good crew. No balls, one strike. Kessler tries to protect the play here. It's there you go. This handle here. And Kessler is going to reach on an error. Bases are loaded. For your second baseman, number three, Ty Ferguson. Ferguson with a couple home runs this, some, this season so far. Second baseman's kind of taking it rough on himself. So here we go. Base hit scores two here. The pitch to Ferguson. It's going to be in the gap. It's going to be mishandled out there. Hines scores. Pont scores. Base hit. Ty Ferguson, that'll make your score 11 to 3. The bottom of the four is still two outs. Runners at first and second. That'll bring up your third baseman, number 11. Tucker Morris. And with Kessler at second, a base hit will score him. The pitch. Out. Oh. <laughs> Outside corner, strike one. That looks like a ball to me. <laughs> So, no balls, one strike, Morris. Pitcher settles in, the 0-1. Inside, ball one. So, this pitcher doesn't have a lot of heat with his fastball. It's more on with movement with this pitcher, which can be difficult to hit. Your batters are always used to that hard fastball coming, and they're not getting it. So they have to adjust. Looks like they're doing pretty good so far. 
Inside pitch, swing and a miss, strike two. One ball, two strikes to Morris. So they'll probably shorten up here and try to protect the plate. Kessler at second. Ferguson at first. The one, two. It's going to be hit to the third baseman. And he's safe. <laughs> And he is going to be called out wow, of first base for the third out. But damage is definitely done here in the ball in the fourth inning. The score is now 11-3, to three Leopards. We're going to take a quick break. We come back to the top of the fifth. You're watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network. One. Welcome back to Lawton Carey Field, where it's senior night, baseball style here in Lindsay, Oklahoma. Leopards up big right now, in the, going to the top of the fifth inning, up 11-3. to Caleb Benz is still your, your pitcher. So we... Have a couple more seniors out there in the field. Seth Padilla being right field and Andy Register being left field now. Getting some more seniors out in some action here on senior night. Love to see that. And love to be able to take them care of business so they're able to do that. You know, district games, you still got need to win the games. and They're definitely taking care of business right they're, now. They're taking care of business and everybody's getting to play, so. Can't ask for much more than that. Number 23, the pitcher, going to be up to bat for the Indians. Also put number 24 on deck. The pitch. That's going to be hit straight away. And Rescher is going to get a chance to do something here. And he'll make the catch for out number one. Outstanding play by the senior left fielder. Just like that, and in register making a play. Love to see that. Number 24, Irwin, the batter now for the Indians. Caleb Benz keeps throwing one pitch outs. He can probably pitch the whole thing here. The pitch to Irwin. Whoa. That same pitch has been called a strike for, for them all night long. Ball one. Here we go, the 1-0 pitch. Same pitch, called strike this time. One ball, one strike. Bowed back. Strike two. One ball, two strikes. On Irwin for the Indians. Ants ahead of the batter here. And settle in. Here's the pitch. Fouled away. Count will remain one and two. Ants is in a rhythm. He's saying, hurry up, boys. Let's go. One, two pitch. Going to be popped up. And Aaron Register is going to have another opportunity here. And he'll make out number two. Love to see that right there, Eric. Two outs. Now we just need to pop up to right field and get Seth Padilla a chance here. Yeah. That's a good roll for um, and Register. It, yep. Yeah. 
So two outs now, top of the fifth. Leopards up 11 to three. Two up, two down. The pitch. Swing and a miss, strike one. Swing and a miss, strike two. No balls, two strikes on number two. Two outs away here, top of the fifth. The 0-2 pitch. And he tried to bunt with two strikes on him. He went foul, so he is out. That'll do it for the fifth, top of the fifth inning. We come back, we'll be in the bottom of the fifth batting again. You're watching Leopard Baseball live on a Leopard Sports Network. Welcome back to Log and Carry Field. Senior and I here in Lindsay, Oklahoma for the Lindsay Leopards. Going to the bottom of the fifth inning. Leopards with a commanding lead, 11 to 3. I believe that music means number 21, the first baseman, Bo Blankenship, will be up the bat first. Here in the bottom of the fifth. Well, that's two innings. Leopard start off with the base hit right out the middle. Let's see what happens here. The pitch. Outside corner, strike one. Clayton Sanders on deck. The 0 1 pitch. That's going to be a base hit. That's going to be a double for Bo Blankenship. Stand up double Bo Blankenship. And that's how the last three innings have been, folks. Eric, that was just fair. It, was, it almost fell. You couldn't ask for a better place ball, I can tell you that. Oh, yeah. Clayton Sanders, his last two at-bats have been double, stand-up doubles. Bo Blinkship with the stand-up double here to start it off. No outs. That'll bring up your catcher, number 22, Clayton Sanders. The 
Leopard seemed to be doing everything right at the plate here. No one holding blanket chip on. The pitch to Sanders. High and outside, ball one. Blanket chip with the lead to second. The 0 1 0. That's going to hit up the middle. That's going to move blanket chip over to third base. But Sanders will be out of first. So one away. If the Leopards have a runner in scoring position at third base, Bo Blankenship, that'll bring up your number four, your center fielder, Mitchell Henson. So here we are, bottom of the fifth, runners in scoring position here. Pitch to Henson. Outside, ball one. The one over to Henson. It's going to be a hard hit ball to the shortstop. It's going to be mishandled. Oh, their error. Blanket ship will score, and Henson will always be first. Safe at first base on a mishandled ball. So just like that, Leopard scored another one. Believe. One away, Mitchell Henson on first base. I believe that the run rule is 10 after 5. We're just going to score one more here in, uh, in this ball game. That'll bring up number one, your pitcher, Kayla Bentz. Henson may still second and third here. The pitch. Hard hit well, off hit. the game. Base hit. Kayla Bentz. Runners at first and second now. That'll bring up your right fielder, number two, Seth Padilla. In the dirt, swinging a miss, strike one. The old one to Padilla. Be high, ball one. So seniors getting the action tonight here. One run away from a run roll. Register on deck for the Leopards. The pitch. That's going to hit him. Bases will now be loaded with one out. Here in the bottom of the fifth, up 12 to 3. And number 13, and in register up to bat. Here we could see the end of the ball game here. Just takes one hit. We're walking. So one base hit away from ending this game. Swing and they fouls it back. Strike one. Good idea. And in register. So the bases are loaded. Padilla at first. Mitchell Henson is over at third. Caleb is the second. And in register your batter. The 0 1 pitch. In the dirt, ball one. One one pitch to register. High ball two. Good 
Pitcher sails in, the 2-1. Right down the middle, strike two. Two balls, two strikes, standing to register. Bases loaded, ball in the fifth. Leopards up 12-3. to three. Fouled away. Stays alive. Count will remain two and two. Kessler on deck. Oh. The pitch in the dirt. Ball three. Full count. The runners will be running here, RJ. Two outs. Full count. Either hit it or you get a walk. Yeah, the runners will be going here. I'm sorry, just one out. They may not be going. Just sorry about that. One out here. The pitch and the dirt. That'll score one. That'll score the game. That should end the game. That will end the game. That'll be in your ball game, folks. It's it's senior night here at Lawton Perry Field in Lindsay, Oklahoma. The Leopards take care of business, run royal fashion in five innings, thirteen to three. We're gonna end the broadcast for tonight. We're gonna watch these festivities. You've been watching Leopard Baseball live on the Leopard Sports Network. <laughs>